Okay, let's see if this is what I need. Uh, sign writing, rigid truck, curtains, using paint mask, and screening. Okay, this might be what I'm looking for. It's okay. I got it. This is a good video, but he's not showing the products that he's using. I need to know what products you're using. Okay, okay. Shut up. Cállate. What I'm going to do here is, you know, I can't find a good video on how to do lettering on curtain side trailers. So, being that I'm doing one right now, I'm going to go out in the shop and um, set it up and show you how to do lettering on what's called a curtain side trailer. Okay, watch this. So there it is. Little curtain van. And I also have one in the shop. Okay, so that's the one that's in the shop and that is the one that we will be doing the demo on. And as you can see, something that Hulk put vinyl lettering on it and the vinyl lettering fell off. I don't know what kind of vinyl they used, but it, it didn't stick too good. So that's why I'm doing it the way I'm doing it. So what we're doing basically, it's paint mask and this stuff here, it's a uh, gloss vinyl ink. I'm going to show you the can. Ink, Ink Tech. Ink Tech Gloss Vinyl Ink. And you can reduce it with lacquer thinner, which is really good. And you can also clean out your paintbrush if you use a paintbrush with lacquer thinner. See the can? I bought this in New York because here in the Northwest, you can only buy it by the gallon. And I don't need a whole gallon, so there's a place in New York, they sell it by the quart comes in different colors and the way I'm going to apply it after the paint mask is put on is with your little rollers I'm going to put the um come on come on come on come on I'm going to put the ink in here and roll it on this way you have nice even coverage without uh, brush strokes coming through so let's get on it and get it done Okay, what I had done is I took the trucks out in the yard and I washed them really good because you got to have it squeaky clean. And now I'm going to go over the whole thing with uh, rapid tech, rapid prep and wipe it down and get started on it. And being that I love to listen to music while I'm working, um, I'm just going to like run this real fast and uh, listen to the radio like I always do, but play some music. All right, here goes.
Monday morning and both of the trucks are done. It uh, went pretty smooth. On the second truck, being that the little plastic uh, paint holders started to melt, what I did is I took a Frisbee and first I just put some uh, vinyl on the bottom, but the ink started like melting the vinyl. I don't know why, it was really weird. So then I decided to take the Frisbee and put aluminum foil inside the Frisbee and that seemed to be the best way to go because it didn't react with any plastic. It seemed to dry not as quickly and um, it, it rolled out really nice. So that was the best way. The Frisbee wrapped with uh, aluminum foil, two pieces of aluminum foil. That was it. Oh, whoop. <laughs> oh boy. Be still, camera. Whoopsie. <laughs> so there you go. And um, the guy's going to come by and pick up these trucks in a little bit and go to work with them. There you go. All right. Thanks for watching. See ya. Bye-bye.